This story has been sponsored by the Art Institutes. When I was younger, I had a lot of friends, and after school, we would hang out all the time and do a ton of really cool and fun stuff, like go explore the woods and ding-dong ditch people. It was a lot of fun. But when middle school came around, they all started doing a ton of sports and got really, really crazy about it. And I just really hated sports. And so slowly, they just stopped hanging out with me. And every time I tried hanging out, they would all have sports to do. And in school, they would only be talking about sports at lunch and stuff. And I could never add to the conversation. And so I just started, like, on the weekends not hanging out or doing anything because they could never hang out. So I just started playing a ton of Xbox. It got so bad that while I was in school, they would barely even talk to me or say hi in the hallways because they were so occupied with sports, we kind of stopped being friends. One time, I tried inviting them all over for a sleepover so we could have fun again, but they said they couldn't because they all had practice. And then later that night, I saw some post of them hanging out on Instagram. So I guess they just didn't want to hang out with me anymore. So my best friends that I had for my whole life were like nobody anymore, and they just completely forgot about me. I felt completely ignored and so alone. I didn't fit into anything, and I started to feel really bad about myself. I started staying home more and more on the weekends and after school because none of my friends wanted to hang out because they all just kind of forgot about me to do sports. And so I started watching a lot of YouTube, and I started watching a ton of channels that did really cool film stuff and animation and really cool stuff like that. And one day I was really bored, so I got the webcam on my computer, and started making like stop motions, which is a really cool way of animating with pictures. And I also started doing like live action film stuff by myself in my house. And I started to really like it and I kind of got good at them. Sometimes I would show my parents them and they said they were pretty cool and stuff. So my mom signed me up for this program for like film and I went to it and it was really awesome because you got to use like really like high quality equipment and really learn about film and get in depth with it and it was really cool. And there were also a lot of really nice kids there that I became friends with that were all into film. My favorite part is directing the movies we make there. And I feel like I finally found what I love to do. Things haven't changed much for me at school because most of the kids only love sports. Even though I miss my old friends, I'm really glad that I found my passion, something that I really love doing all the time. and I'm really happy now. We want to thank the Art Institutes for sponsoring this story and supporting our creativity to animate your stories. So how many of you story boothers are super creative? Maybe you like to make movies or cook or design interiors or animate just like we do. We want all of you out there who have a creative passion to pursue it and that's why we're so excited about the Art Institutes. The Art Institutes offers courses that can help you pursue your creativity and passion. There are so many different courses to choose from. From fashion, to gaming, to visual design and media arts, there are endless options for igniting your creative spark. You can take courses either online or on campuses across the country. If you click on the link in the description below, you can check out all their course options and see what's a match for you. So go for it, and remember, never stop pursuing your creativity. Go give Art Institute some love by clicking the link in the description below, and you will see how they can help you turn your creative passion into a reality. Oh my god, and we totally jumped off the cliff and had to swim all the way to shore because the dog chased us all the way to the end. Oh.